Good morning, everybody. Good morning, grandmas. Hope everyone had a Merry Christmas and is going to have a Happy New Year. This video is gonna be kind of different. It's just sales, literally just sales. I've gotten messages from some people and yes, I have been stressed out about the wedding, stressed out about just getting people in one location, paying a bunch of money for society standards of a ceremony, the job application, and I'm actually having a phone interview next week with like five people that are gonna grill me about stuff. I think I'm gonna film a loan payment update video to release tomorrow and then after that my bike tour videos should resume so thanks everybody for watching and this is just sales who remembers the valentine one i picked up in lubbock texas paid like 169 used it during my road trip and sold it on ebay for 250 this daiwa bg 20 fishing reel has been listed for a long long time sold for 55 dollars getting shipped to Spain, España. And then this Sony VCR DVD recorder sold for 120 on Amazon. So this is a Sony DVD recorder, sorry, Sony CD recorder. I bought it for 30, eventually, originally sold on Amazon for 300, got returned with damages, so I put it up on eBay. It's not playing anything, it's not working now. I just sold it for 60 bucks. This Patagonia Parka, purple and blues size large men's and this thing is like huge on me it feels like an xl but it's size large it does have a removable hood and it had the hood it sold for 120 bucks sold this villager amiibo with some damage on it sold for 15 dollars lost money on that this super nintendo game new horizons this sold for 40 dollars Dreamcast controller mint condition sold for $17 shipped my mom bought this tennis racket while i was in california <laughs> She saw me selling some pretty heavy hitting tennis rackets, so she tried her hand on it and bought one. This, however, was a trombone. We had to take the grip off, and she bought it for $2.99, and it sold for $8. I don't know the legality on this, but other people are doing it, so I threw mine up on eBay. It's a United voucher. It was valued at $400, and this sold for like $365. Soul.hack quarantine. This is part four. This is an extremely expensive video game. Uh, got it in a pawn shop in a lot with a lot of dot hack games included, like a stack of them, a full complete set. The other dot hacks or whatever. Anyways, this was a complete inbox, gorgeous copy. I sold this for $149.99. And we sold some of these uh, wholesale item that I have for $9. Sold this Pro Kinex, Pro Kinex racquetball racket, sold for $25. Picked it up for four or $5. Just listed this little, um, the day before it sold. Sold for $64.99. Badokai Tenkaichi 3, complete in the box. Bugs Bunny Rabbit Rampage, sold for $6. Sold an adapter that goes to a CB radio for $13. These outdoor research, Outdoor research, outdoor research pants. They're like three quarters, like weird capri pants for men. Size 36, they sold for $44. And I bought these in LA for $4.99. Illusions of Gaia sold for $20. Big sell on Spider-Man for the Game Boy Color sold for $4.28. This was just listed, sold quickly. Knights of the Old Republic sold for $14.99. One of the Amiibos from the Amiibo crash sold for $8.57, lost money on that. Sold these, but the guy didn't pay because he didn't know that they were size 8, even though 8's in the description right there. Uh, sold this Bob Stroller thing, picked this up in California for like $4 maybe. Sold for $27.88. Had these Jordans for way too long, finally sold them for $25. Sold a pair of weightlifting gloves I got from Goodwill for a dollar. Sold for $9. Finally sold this Hart, I think it's a Hartman luggage. I don't know, it was in a vlog. I bought it for like maybe five to $10. Had it up for 90, took a best offer for 55. It's like suede on the outside and it does have a key with it. So that's good. Sold the Abercrombie shorts that I picked up in California for like a dollar. And then after I bought them, I found out that I had a trombone missing button, listed them as is, sold them for $40. Donkey Kong 1 and 2 sold that for $10. Zelda 2 The Adventures of Link with the game. The instruction manual sold that for $22. Sold a pair of shoelaces from Gander Mountain for $9. And sold an old TV weather Sony radio on Amazon for $30. Merchant fulfilled. 
Sold a really ugly copy of Super Smash Brothers Melee. It's all cracked out and scratched out. Sold this for $25, as is unplayable. Sold Ninja Gaiden 2 for $10. Sold Spin Out, which I picked up in a vlog a while ago for $21. And sold this Harley Davidson that I picked up in California. It was size large. It's going to a subscriber. He sent me a message on eBay and uh, we negotiated the price down to uh, $2.99, $2.99. I wanted to send it to him for free, but he insisted on paying something, so $2.99. That'll be going to him, and I appreciate him watching the videos, so I think that's cool. So this Polo sold a little bit more than you would think. It sold for $29 because it's a 4XLT. Sold a pair of these weightlifting gloves that I bought from Goodwill for about a dollar a piece. Sold for $9. Sold an instruction manual to Excite Bike for like two dollars and something cents. I lost money on this. It's gonna cost me more to ship this. Took this one out of the Rally Roots book. It's a marmot jacket, really nice marmot jacket, but embroidered Samsung, embroidered Samsung there. Sold for 40 bucks. Not bad. I don't know if anyone cares about this, but I'm about to sell my scooter for $350. I paid 500 for it, I'm gonna lose. So I'll lose uh, 150 bucks, but it'll be gone. I learned my lesson. Scooter is gone, $350, cold hard cash. Sold this one steel jaw patch for $9 something. And I sold this Lululemon rack pack bra. Lululemon, brand new with tags. I want to say I paid 18 for it and it sold for $39. Sorry, it wasn't that Lululemon, it was this one. It sold for $39. And that was just sales. Granted, it was over about a week and a few days and not every week is like this. It was a lot of Christmas sales and I do have a lot of really good like video game items that we're selling that were from my personal collection. Thank you so much everyone for watching. If you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up. Encouraging comments are greatly appreciated and I will talk to you guys in the next video tomorrow. Bye.